I must ask you a question. Do you have your Halloween costume picked out yet? If you haven't bought one yet, don't. Today, I'm here to not only help you save money on a costume, but create one that's totally unique. Because what's worse than spending buku bucks on a packaged costume only to see yourself show up at the party? And why go spending an arm and a li hand on something you're only gonna wear once or twice? Unless you end up wearing it more often, like on the daily, in which case you'd be getting your money's worth, but you probably also have issues that I can't help you with. Anyway, tip number one, how to come up with your costume idea. Just think of someone or something that you've always wanted to be. If nothing comes to mind, then think of some of your favorite movies and storybooks, cartoons, what have you, and pull characters from there. And don't forget about both living and dead celebrities. Then, think of two to three major identifying features of that person or thing. Like, when you'd see those details, you'd think, oh, I get it. Do a little additional research, be it online, by rewatching the movie or rereading the book. This will allow you to get a solid image of what you're going for. Then, make a list of what you need. Tip number two is how to buy what you need. Before you go anywhere, take a look at what you already have. Chances are you've got a lot more to your costume already than you realize. This can even include borrowing from friends, parents, or siblings, although you should probably ask them first. Then, hit the thrift stores. I got all the major pieces for these outfits from places like Salvation Army and Goodwill for less than $5 a piece. Then, be sure to check out dollar stores in the area. I got this mask at one for $2. More often than not, you'll be able to find the little things like makeup, glitter, ribbon, felt, things that you'll need to add to your costume for far cheaper at places like this. And tip three, little things to keep in mind. Face paints are far cheaper than buying a mask, and you get to customize them way more too. I hate to say it, but we have seen snow on Halloween. Because it may get really cold, try and make a jacket, coat, or sweatshirt a part of your costume. And when it comes down to it, it's all in the details. And often, those little additions are the most inexpensive details. This Halloween, save your money for the treats and show up sporting a totally one-of-a-kind and affordable costume. Or just wear one of these mustaches, because no one's gonna do that this year. Have fun and be safe, guys!